I know I shouldn't be doing this, but... It just tastes so good. Coffee. It's good for the soul. But not in too high of doses for too many days in a row, like I did probably about two weeks ago. Now, look. Guys, we're back for another video. Thanks for joining me. Welcome back to another video. Today's video is pretty exciting. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna keep you waiting, guys. Look at this. Look at this. Doesn't this just make you fucking excited? For me. You know, excited for me, guys. What is in here? What is in here? In the last video, I opened a, an amazing present. It was, a, it was a small present, but it was sick. It was a Chiefs uh, flag. And it was a, um, a packet of Chiefs football cards. Football trading cards from Thanksgiving Day in 2000 and 2005. So they were, at, they were 13 years old, man. What a great gift. What an awesome gift to receive. And that's why I'm wearing this top. Because I just opened it probably about five minutes ago. And we've got a second parcel. And this one is slightly bigger. Just as, just as important. Just as special. It's from Wesley Beard. And he comes from LA, Bosia City. I won't give his uh, full address, but Bosia City, Wesley Beard. Let me find his, um, let me find his Instagram page, give, give him a shout out. Because that's something I'm not prepared to do, guys. I'm not prepared to make any of these videos without, you know, being able to really give at least a shout out or, you know, drop their name. Um, and it hasn't been easy to try and find some of these people who've, who've sent me, because I mean, I'm getting a shitload of messages on Instagram, and, and one of my, you know, one of my things that I am big on is trying to reply to every single message I ever get on Instagram. You know, YouTube, I completely forgot about. I couldn't, I couldn't get back to anyone's comments, but Instagram's a little bit different. You know, when I do have a few hours, which is what you need, if I do have a block of a few hours free, well, not free, but you know, free enough. Um, I'll sit down and I'll 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 spend two, three hours on Instagram just replying to messages. It's just the way it is. It's what you got to do, or else people will never hear back from you. And I'm hoping that these people, you know, I'm going to talk some real talk right now. The the people that I do hit up, the people that I do get back to, sorry, they hit me up. I get back to them. I'm hoping that, you know, whether they expect me to or not, I'm hoping that it improves their life in some way. I'm hoping that it makes them happy, it makes their day, um, just like their message makes mine. And that's what it's all about. So, my man, Wesley, I don't know if, he, if he'd actually want me to um, shout out his Instagram page, but if you guys do want to go over there and, and send him a quick message and say, you know, what a legend for sending me this stuff, his uh, Instagram name is wes.wes.946954. .wes you know, he's, he's got his kids on there and stuff. I don't know if I... Yeah, I don't know. It's up to you guys. I know my supporters are, are all decent people, so you're not going to go bombard his page. But I want to say thank you, Wes. And let's get into opening this package. Now, I should, <laughs> I should have been prepared better with a knife. But I don't have it. And it looks like I've got a, an easy peel option right here. So, let's... Let's do it. How cool is this? I mean, literally, like six months ago, I would never even have imagined that someone would want to send me something. Or well, some things, actually. It looks like there's... Well, it looks like there's five things in here. Oh, man. This is like Christmas. Christmas in September. It's the 4th of September right now. We've just hit 100,000 subscribers. I mean, I'm... I'm happy. I'm content for now. That's not going to last. I want 200. And you guys are going to all be part of it, man. I want you to be. I want you to feel like you're part of it. Including you, Wesley. Whew, let's have a look. Oh, that looks like a beanie. I want a beanie. <laughs> I don't know, it might be a bit small for my head. I've got a big head, man. Tigers. Tigers. Which is the... Is it Alabama? The type? Oh man, this is... Look at this. <laughs> okay, we've got the beanie. I'm going to take this off now, don't I? We've got a kid up, man. Yeah. Okay, so Tigers... 
Tigers, I'm not, I, I can't remember. I feel terrible, but I can't remember who the Tigers are. So I'm going to put it on and work it out later. <laughs> Moment of truth. <laughs> I've got a big head, by the way. <laughs> oh, man. How's this going to look? Whoa! <laughs> That's a tight beanie. Woo! But it doesn't matter, man. All good. Sweet. What is this? Another flag? Oh, yes. The Auburn Tigers, not the bloody... What did I say? Alabama. I only said that because I saw an A on here. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful? Wow. <laughs> yeah, I reckon that'll look real nice up here. I don't think I'm going to have enough wall space soon. Auburn Tigers. Well, it looks like a reaction is going to be in store. That's for sure. Okay, well, it doesn't stop there, guys. It doesn't stop there. What else have we got? Oh, what? An Auburn jumper? Bruh. I might just have my first favourite university. 18 for Auburn. Who is that? I wonder. We've got a size large. Man, that is... Oh, well, stuff this one. Put this back on. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> let's keep going. We've got something else. I might have to change my top again. Another one. Peace. Peace. The old fashioned way. And I think he sent me this because it has something, he, he works in the Air Force. Yes, that's right, he does. Huh. Thank you, man. I'm going to wear that. Definitely I'm going to wear that. And I want to say thank you for your service. Oh, shit. I was right. Look at that. Eagle Crest. Eagle Crest, United States Air Force. Wow. B-52, he works on the B-52s. He does. That is sick, man. And you know what? It, 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 it's jogged my memory. He's, he's said to me in the past, we've had a, a running conversation going um, for a couple of months now, and he said in the past that, you know, my videos sort of, he can just escape. He can come home, maybe crack a beer, I don't know what he's, what he's doing, and watch my videos and enjoy the game of football, enjoy my reactions and, and take his mind off, off other things. And I've got a, a few messages from a few people saying that kind of thing. And it, it does put a bit of pressure on me, but I, I, I understand where he's coming from because I've been in that boat with other creators on YouTube. You know, I've used other creators' videos to, to help me through life and through, through periods of life that have been you know, negative or boring or, or, yeah, whatever, but, man, what a legend. And we've got one more. Oh, man, well, he's got a letter here. We're going to read that at the end. But we've got, look at this, man. Oh, what? Someone signed this, bruh. Look at this. <laughs> Falcons. Bro, go Air Force, Troy, Troy Calho, Troy Calha, I'm blown away, I'm absolutely blown away, let's hope that this letter tells me who that is, that's, fuck man, wow, hi Jacob, hi Jacob, the coin, <laughs> it's a drinking game, is it? Is it a drinking game? Okay, let's, let's see. My name is Wesley Beard. I'm in the UA, USAF, the US Air Force. I'm a crew chief and currently work on B-52 bombers. I love the channel and have enclosed in this package a few things I thought you would enjoy and appreciate. I certainly have, man. First and most important is my lucky University of Auburn jersey. It is not fresh ordered from Amazon, 
but it is my favourite one. Really, bruh? You sent me your favourite jersey? Fucking hell, man. Second, a reversible Auburn beanie. Oh, it's reversible. Huh. I was wondering what that was on the outside. <laughs> nah, I like this side better. Let's put it back on. First and most important is my lucky University of Auburn jersey. It is not fresh ordered from Amazon. It is not freshly ordered from Amazon, but it's my favorite one. Ugh. Hang on. <laughs> Second, a reversible Auburn beanie. Third is a small Air Force football helmet. Ah, oh, the Air Force team. They must be called the Falcons. Third is a small Air Force football helmet that is signed by the head coach. Fourth is a B-52 t-shirt that is made here at Barksdale AFB, Louisiana, where I'm stationed at. Okay. Fifth is a challenge coin. We've got a challenge coin. It is a tradition carried on the US is a tradition carried on in the US military with the rules attached below. I truly hope you like the items I've sent you and they make it into one of your videos. Well they certainly have, man. They certainly have. Keep up the great content and looking forward to getting in one of those fantasy leagues. Well, I can't, I'm sorry, you won't get into a fantasy league because we're only doing one this year. But everything else, man, it's absolutely amazing. Challenge coin rules. Let's, let's run through these rules. And then, I think in the next video I'm going to have to do an Auburn, I'm definitely going to have to do an Auburn, um, Auburn Tigers reaction video, for sure. <laughs> this is crack up. Alright. Rules of the coin game. Coin game must be given or explained to all new coin holders. <laughs> I am a new coin holder. Look at that. I'm, look at that. Putting it in my pocket. Okay. The coin must be carried at all times. You can be challenged for it anywhere at any time. You must produce the coin without taking more than four steps to produce it. <laughs> when challenging, the challenger must state whether it is for a single drink or a round of drinks. Failure to produce a coin for whatever reason results in a, in a bought round of, or single drinks, whatever the challenger's state is. Okay, so if I challenge you, you don't have the coin, you automatically lose. This type of transaction could be expensive, so hold on to your coin. Once the offender, the coinless challengee, has bought the drink or round, they can't be challenged again. If all that, if all that are challenged... If all that are challenged produce their coins, the challenger loses and must buy the drinks for all respondents. This too can be expensive, so challenge wisely. Under no circumstances can a coin be handed to another in response to a challenge. Okay. If a person gives their coin to another, that person can now keep the coin. It's theirs. However, if a person places the coin down and another person picks it up to examine it, that is not considered giving and the examiner is on a bound to place the coin back where they got it. The examiner can't challenge while they, while they hold another's coin. The examiner can't challenge while the examiner can't challenge while they hold another's coin. After negotiating a reasonable ransom, the examiner must return the member's coin. If a coin is lost, replacement is up to the individual. A new coin should be acquired at the earliest opportunity. Losing a coin and not replacing it doesn't relieve a member of his or her responsibilities. This is especially true if your fellow CPOs know that you traditionally carry a coin. CPO. Chief something officer. There is no exceptions to the rules. They apply to clothed or unclothed. <laughs> One step and an arm's reach are allowed. A coin is a coin. They are not belt buckles, keychains or necklaces. Coins worn in a holder around the neck are valid. <laughs> that happens? Are you serious? The coin should be controlled at all times. Giving a coin to anyone, giving a coin to just anyone, is like opening a, a fraternity to just anyone. It is an honour to be given a coin. Let's keep it that way. A given or awarded coin is of more personal value than a purchased coin. No holes may be drilled in a coin. And number 12, the last rule, 
The above rules apply to anyone who is worthy to be given or awarded a coin, has purchased a coin, or is known to be a previous coin holder. That is special. That is special. It really is, man. It makes me want to join the Air Force. <laughs> you know what, man? You know what, when I do come to the US, I'll definitely be having this on me. There's no doubt. So I can, I can literally go to a bar and challenge someone. You can be challenged for it anywhere you produce. When challenging, the challenger must state whether it's for a single drink. It's just, it's basically, you don't even play a game. It's literally just, if I see you and I think you don't have your coin on you, I'm going to challenge you, mate. <laughs> then if everyone has it, I'm in the shit. What a freaking cool thing, man. What, what, a, what a great package. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you, Wes. i got to say, man, excuse the language. I'm, I'm feeling like I probably shouldn't swear so much in my videos, but what a fucking legend. What a fucking legend. You've absolutely made my day. Um, and my next video is going to be on Auburn. So, thank you, man. Thank you. I'm going to add this jersey to the collection. Got some nice colours here, man. Boom, baby. Let's go. AU. And we've got this too. The coach. Coach of the Air Force. Team. Amazing. Amazing. So anyways, guys. If you have liked this video, please press like. If you want to subscribe, please do, and I'll see you guys back here very shortly, okay? What a, what a great, what a great thing, you know? It's fantastic. Thanks, guys. Peace out. Have a good one.